Hello, bonjour. I made four new brushes for Krita 5 and in this video I will show you how to install them and how I use them. So at first you need to download the zip file, you'll find the link into the description. After the download, extract the bundle file somewhere on your system. Open Krita, go to settings, manage resource libraries and click the import button. Now locate your bundle file where you put it on your disk and then select it and press open. After that, a socket with the bundle will appear right at the end of your list. It has a frame around it and that means the bundle is activated. So now go ahead, close this dialog, create a new file and then you can scroll your brush list and you will find the four new brushes side by side. <laughs> you are set to paint with them. If you met any problem with this install process, please check the description. The software might change and I will try to add complementary information on the description along the next years in this case. Uh, the first one I want to show is the flat paintbrush with variation. Uh, sorry for the very original name. Uh, this one might look a little bit weird at first on this pack, but this brush is really great for blocking big volumes at a very early step of your piece. So it means uh, you can create a rich texture with a very interesting pattern inside the stroke because the color is constantly color shifting. The second brush is the flat paint brush creamy and this one takes advantages of new development in Krita 5. Uh, you'll experience a very good ability to mix colors when you use this one at low pressure. You'll also experience a tool that can really paint sharp accents at full pressure and cut big shape with very strong edges. So it's a very versatile tool and uh, it's probably the main brush on my bundle. The third brush, Flat Paint Brush Dry, is a preset that produces softer edges if I compare it to the two previous brushes. It brings a good contrast of rendering with the two previous brushes and I use it to paint the shape that has a soft edges all around it, sort of like bushes, trees, or when I need just to rub lightly an area to bring a little bit more of color vibration to it. Finally, the last one in my list, the flat small brush for solid edge. Uh, well, it has everything in the title. Uh, so it's a brush that covers the area with full opacity and with a solid clean edge. Uh, but you still preserve a little bit of expression, especially at low pressure, and uh, you get that small texture on the tail of the brush. So this stroke is perfect to draw small detail on the top, and especially uh, those type of details that are made of a single brush stroke. So I recorded four studies and uh, I accelerated the movies. So what you will see is how I used these brushes and uh, not only these brushes, I used also uh, other brushes from my previous brush set from the Krita default. And um, this type of studies took me between 30 minutes to one hour each. Uh, I had a timer for that uh, and I will indicate the real time on the video. So I hope all these time lapse and these brushes will bring you inspiration to dive into speed painting. Um, and for the voiceover, I'm stopping here. So I'm launching the music. See you next time and thanks for watching. Bye bye.